was exciting to share with other artists because I knew it could work for anyone. I mean, I literally found the secret to growing a sustainable, successful online business for painters, photographers, jewelers, any small brand could grow a business at whatever level they want. And I wanted to share this with all the artists I knew. So I was doing 35 shows a year selling my work, traveling art festival after art festival after art festival, working all week in the shop, loading my van, traveling to the next show. I was at a show when I first met my wife and we got married, we had children. My oldest daughter was traveling with us to shows. Even though there was a show or two that my wife would go to with with um, our daughter, our daughters. Most shows I did by myself. And so I was away from my family 100 days a year, some years more than that. It was always an ache in my heart that I was on the road during special events. I was on the road always during special holidays. I was home for Christmas, but all during the Christmas season, I was traveling doing shows. I would travel for three to four weeks in a row away from home during the summer. So the times when my wife is home with the kids swimming in the pool, I was in another town, in another boring hotel room, sitting at another festival, hoping it wouldn't rain. Years at the shows gives you lots of time to think about things. I knew that the internet would have an impact on my business somehow, but I didn't know how. Okay, in fact, it took me years before I even wanted to have a website because I couldn't understand why a website mattered. You know, I was at the shows, people would buy from me at shows, and why would they buy from me on a website? You know, how would they even know I existed? Nobody's gonna get up in the morning and search for what I create. But as the internet evolved over the last, let's say, 10 years, that's when I started looking at it really seriously, and I recognized that the internet is a place where people are shopping. What I was doing for years in the real world is going to shows. So I was actively marketing in the real world, finding events that were good events that would have the right kind of crowd. So I would go to that event, try and get a good booth location. I was basically trying to bring my work to an audience and get in front of a very specific audience, people that would come to this festival. And so I'd done that for years in the real world. So now it was time to look at the internet and say, can I make a shift? Can I go on the internet and put my work in front of some very specific people? How do you even do that? Is there a way to make that happen? It fell into line when I recognized that there are platforms out there like Facebook and Instagram where you can use their platform to target and get in front of some very specific people. The AI allows you to optimize in a way that you would never even know how to optimize. And what that simply means is you are getting in front of some very specific people. It's kind of like a, an art show analogy would be if you could filter the attendance of an art show and only have the people who will fall in love with your work come past your booth. That's what you're able to do on the internet. The world is, is your marketplace. My goal was, can I go online and start selling my work in a, in a way that I make enough profit to eliminate the shows I don't like to do? Can I supplement that income? And so that's what I realized pretty quick that I absolutely could. I started having success pretty rapidly once I understood where to focus my attention. And artists would come to me who would typically see me at many other shows and they would say, David, where have you been? I simply said, my website business is exploding. And their next, you know, the next logical question is, how are you doing that? And so I would answer them by saying, well, you know, I'm using my Facebook page, my Instagram page. I'm using, you know, I'm growing an email list and I'm turning you know, all of these fans into customers, into repeat customers, into people who are spreading the word about my brand. It was exciting to share with other artists what was happening because I knew it could work for anyone. I mean, absolutely, I had found the secret to blowing up a small brand. I mean, I literally had found the secret to blowing up a small brand, making their business grow to whatever level they wanted and I wanted to share it with all the artists that I knew. I would pull out my iPad and I would open up my Facebook account and I would show them, you know, they were fascinated. They wanted to know more. And so I got to a point where I wanted to teach other artists how to do this. And so I developed a free masterclass that I teach every week. 
And in that free masterclass, I show you all of the things that I'm doing so that you can have the same online success that I'm having. Any small brand can do this. It's not complicated, but it is very specific. I wanted to put together some kind of curriculum that they could follow. I wanted them to have a step-by-step -step process, uh, an execution plan, so that they could duplicate the same success I was having. So all of this culminated in the creation of my free masterclass, because I love to teach people how to see this. I love to open their eyes to this amazing opportunity to grow their business to whatever size they want. The magic was happening because of the pieces I put together. It wasn't happening, the success was not happening because of the internet. It wasn't happening because of Facebook and Instagram. It wasn't happening because of the targeting tools. It was happening because of how I took my real world experience and I wove it together with an understanding of how these platforms work, an understanding of how the algorithms and the AI works. And when you weave that together, that's what produces success. And there's so much information on the internet that you don't need more information. What you need is a clear step-by-step -step process from someone in your industry, somebody just like you, a small business owner, who has figured out how to use the internet, how to use a few specific tools, and how to get them to work for an online business. And so that's what I put in my free masterclass. I want people to have access to this information. I want people to have access to the recipe, if you will, so that they don't have to stumble through it all like I did to try and figure out, how do you take this big thing called the internet and make it work for a small brand. And so that's what my free masterclass is all about. It's about an execution plan. It's about a recipe. You just follow the steps and success comes. It's not only a game changer for me, but it's a game changer for everyone that I teach it to. And so that means, for me, it means I'm home with my family. It means I can enjoy my weekends. I can jump in a kayak and go for a paddle with my daughter. I can go for a hike. I can take a weekend off and go up into the mountains. I can spend time with the people I love and do the things I love. So in my free masterclass, I teach people how to find their exact customers. I teach them how to use their Facebook and Instagram page to grow a fan base of repeat loyal customers. I teach them how to set up a sustainable online business. I teach you how to target, how to find your right customers, what to put in front of those people. I teach you how to stay focused. I teach you how to use your Instagram page, your Facebook page, and I teach you how to not be overwhelmed because it's not complicated. It's a formula, and that's why I call it the artist marketing formula. So look around this video, look around on this page. Somewhere next to this video, you're gonna see a link. Click the link, it's going to bring you to the registration page. On that registration page, you can pick the day and time that fits your schedule for my next free masterclass. I love teaching artists how easy it is to have online success. I look forward to seeing you on the next masterclass.